If you like Rachel McAdams, you should definitely watch our picks for her best movies. Wait, wait, um, you don't have to do this. I, I have kids at home. Not with that ass, you don't. Oh, well, thank you. We hope you will enjoy the following ranking. Please let us know your favorite in the comments, and make sure to subscribe to never miss a good movie again. Number 10. The Time Traveler's Wife, 2009. You told me this would happen, and I'm supposed to act normal, but I'm not really acting very normal. The Time Traveler's Wife is a 2009 romantic science fiction drama film based on Audrey Niffenegger's 2003 novel of the same name. Directed by Robert Schwentke, the film stars Eric Bana, Rachel McAdams, and Ron Livingston. The story follows Henry, a Chicago librarian with a paranormal genetic disorder that causes him to randomly time travel as he tries to build a romantic relationship with Claire. Even though Henry's trips make everyday life difficult, he falls in love with Claire, who has to be prepared for longer separations. Look, I know how odd this must be for you. It's, it's odd for me, but, um... Would you like to have dinner with me? And I'll explain. Number 9. State of Play, 2009. We can't just let people get hurt look, like that. We look, can't it's over. just keep letting people right. get it's killed. Right. It's okay. No, it's not okay. It's okay. State of Play is a 2009 political thriller film directed by Kevin McDonald and stars Russell Crowe, Ben Affleck, Rachel McAdams, and Helen Mirren. A handsome, intellectual rising star, Congressman Stephen Collins has a promising political career ahead. But an unsolved tragedy becomes a bigger threat to him than anyone could have imagined. Buried secrets suddenly reveal themselves, causing a series of events that not only lead Collins on a dark path, but even threaten to destroy entire power structures. You're just seeking the truth, that's all. You're just, you're a truth seeker. That's all, you can't help it, so you are. You're such a hypocrite. You're not interested in me. Maybe coming here was all about you and getting your story. I trusted you. Number 8. Sherlock Holmes, A Game of Shadows, 2011. Did you imagine, Miss Adler, that something would happen to you? Is that why you chose to meet here in a public place, your favorite restaurant? Sherlock Holmes, A Game of Shadows is a 2011 period action mystery film directed by Guy Ritchie and stars Robert Downey Jr., Jude Law, Numi Rapace, and Rachel McAdams. Mr. Holmes is always the smartest man in the room, or was. In this installment, he finds a new enemy, at least an intellectual equal to himself. This fast-paced sequel explores new depths of this iconic character, combined with spectacular action, charismatic performances, and most importantly, many new mysteries to be solved by the world's greatest detective. Nice car. I like. <laughs> Number 7. Southpaw 2015. Well, I mean, Billy's been my fighter for 10 years. I know what's best for him. And I've been his wife for like 100. I know what's better for him. Southpaw is a 2015 sports drama film directed by Antoine Fuqua and stars Jake Gyllenhaal, Forrest Whitaker, and Rachel McAdams. The film follows Billy Hope, a boxer who sets out to get his life back on track after a fatal incident sends him on a rampant path of destruction. He begins to fall into a great depression. But when the decision regarding the custody of his daughter is under question, Billy decides to get his life back on track by getting back into the ring. This is a good night. I love you. You are all I care about. The three of us. That's it. That's all that matters. So I'm going to tell you the truth. You're going to be punch drunk in two years if you keep this up. Number 6. Doctor Strange 2016. Oh, you had fun. They weren't about us, they were about you. Not only about me. Stephen, everything is about you. Doctor Strange is a 2016 superhero film directed by Scott Derrickson and stars Benedict Cumberbatch, Chiwetel Ejiofor, Rachel McAdams, Benedict Wong, and Tilda Swinton. One of the most extravagant entries in the Marvel Cinematic Universe, the story follows the brilliant Dr. Stephen Strange, an arrogant and self-centered surgeon. But after losing his craft through an accident, a journey of self-discovery leads him to the truly strange world of magic and myth. And with a new craft, he will return as the master of magic, Dr. Strange.
Number 5. Sherlock Holmes, 2009. I found these exquisite dates in Jordan. And your favorite? Olives from the Cyclades? Sherlock Holmes is a 2009 period mystery action film directed by Guy Ritchie and stars Robert Downey Jr., Jude Law, Rachel McAdams, and Mark Strong. Fast, stylized, and packed with creative action scenes, the charming but cynical Sherlock Holmes and his companion, Dr. Watson, investigate a case that couldn't be more mysterious. The perfect challenge for the infamous mastermind. But soon, both understand the real obstacles and upcoming challenges that will put their friendship in everlasting danger. As your doctor, he'll be straight as a trivet in no time. As your friend! You've been in this room for two weeks. I insist you have to get out. There's nothing of interest for me out there on Earth at all. Number 4. Midnight in Paris, 2011. Oh my god, what, what are you guys doing? Daddy it, had chest pains. Oh, are you really? Yeah, are you, I'm sure it's just indigestion. Midnight in Paris is a 2011 fantasy comedy film written and directed by Woody Allen and stars Owen Wilson, Rachel McAdams, Kathy Bates, and Adrian Brody. This sweetly sentimental story follows a family moving to Paris because of business and two young lovers engaged to marry each other. It's about a man's love for the wonders of a beautiful city and the illusion that a life different from ours would be much better. Kel, why are you so dressed up? Me? No, 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 I'm not. I, I, I've been writing. I was just doing a little writing. What, you dress up and put on cologne to write? No, no, I took a sh I, I jumped in the shower just for a second, just because you know how I think better in the shower and I get the, the positive ions going in there. Number three, The Notebook, 2004. I'm Noel Calhoun. So? So it's really nice to Allie, meet you. Who is this guy? I don't know, No Calhoun. I would really like to take you out. Friend, do you mind? The Notebook is a 2004 romantic drama film directed by Nick Cassavetes and stars Ryan Gosling and Rachel McAdams. When the young and charming Noah meets Jean, they soon develop a strong bond that will hold for years to come. But their love is again and again challenged by the obstacles of life. Separated by World War II, the two lovers lose each other and become completely different people. But love finds its way. God damn my head slipping. The crowd to fire, you idiot! Not until she agrees! Oh, go out with him, honey! Okay, okay, fine. I'll go out with you. Well, don't do me any favors. No, no, I want to! You want it. Yes! Say it. I want to go out with you. Say it again. I want to go out with you. All right, all right, we'll go out. Number two. About time, 2013. You're dying. No, not that bad. I'm dying. No, my parents are in town. They're visiting and they're coming around. About Time is a 2013 romantic comedy drama film and stars Domhnall Gleeson, Rachel McAdams, and Bill Nye. At 21, Tim Lake discovers that he can travel back in time. Moving from the Cornwall coast to London to train as a lawyer, Tim finally meets the beautiful but precarious Mary. As his unusual life progresses, Tim discovers that his unique gift cannot save him from sorrows, ups and downs that are familiar to all families around the world. If it's true, uh, which it isn't. Although it is. Although it isn't, obviously. But if it was, which it's not. Which it is. Which it isn't. But if it was, how would I actually... The how is the easy bit, in fact. You go into a dark place. Big cupboards are very useful, generally. Toilets at a pinch. Then you clench your fists like this. Think of the moment you're going to, and you'll find yourself there. Before we unveil movie number one, here are a few honorable mentions. You do not come to a party at my house with Gretchen and then scam on some poor innocent girl right in front of us three days later. She's not interested. Do you want to have sex with him? No, thank you. Good. So it's settled. So you can go shave your back now. Well, I, I think you might have to deal me out on this because we we're going to... Nonsense, I insist. John, you got to go. You're going to love it. You're going to love it. Zach, honey, um, you a little bit sick for hunting? Oh, no, I'm great. Honey, I'm great. Oh, I'm going. Right? <laughs> Right? <laughs> Guys, this is Madison. Yeah, you brought her last week. You work at Forever 21, right? No, no. I work at Sephora. I'm confused. Different girl. Same same look, same voice. Nice to meet you. You too. <laughs> <laughs> Number one. Spotlight 2015. We're not going away. We're going to tell this story. We're going to tell it right. We just need a little more time. That's all we're asking for. Spotlight is a 2015 biographical drama film directed by Tom McCarthy and stars Mark Ruffalo, 
Michael Keaton, Rachel McAdams, Liev Schreiber, and Stanley Tucci. In the true story-based movie, the editor of the Boston Globe, Marty Baron, assigns a team of journalists named The Spotlight to investigate allegations against the unfrocked priest John Gogan, who is accused of molesting more than 80 children. We get to see the reporters interviewing victims, trying to prove a cover-up of sexual abusing actions within the Roman Catholic Church. We gotta nail these scumbags! We gotta show people that nobody can get away with this! Not a priest or a cardinal or a freaking pope! Do you agree with our list? Please let us know in the comments. If you want to know more about a particular movie in this list, you can check out our links in the video description. And for more top 10 movie videos, be sure to subscribe to Community TV.